Okay, quick video to show you guys how to get the pictures from your phone into the assignment document that you see here. Um, so you should have taken your images from your phone. And what I usually do um, is just email them to myself. So um, in your phone, just email them to your school email. That's going to be best. So I come over here um, and I have my school email and I have my image here. You might only be able to email two pictures at a time. Um, just kind of try it out and see. So I have the image. So if you just hover over the image, oops, you can click on it, but hover over the image and then there's a little button that just says save to drive. Just click that. And so it will automatically save to your drive. You'll have a little window that opens up here that's telling you it's saving to your Chromebook. I don't have a Chromebook, but it's going to save to your drive. Okay. So then you're going to come back to the assignment and you want the photo to go into the photo column here. So I'm going to put the cursor here. I'm going to click there. Then I'm going to come up to insert and then we're inserting an image. So I'm going to hover over image and I'm going to come down to drive. So that's where it's at. If you are someone who does Google photos um, and it's automatically collecting to your school Google photos, then you can just get it from there. Um, but otherwise, you can grab it from your drive since we know we saved it. So then over here, um, I believe it's going to look similar for you guys on your Chromebook. You'll see your recent um, downloads. And so there's my picture. I'm going to click and then insert that. And then I'm going to make it just a little bit bigger. You don't want the document to be too large. And it should fill the box. I don't know what's going on. So you can resize and adjust. That's really stretched out. So hopefully yours look a little bit better. But um, feel free to make it larger in the box so that we can really see um, what features you're trying to point out. So then next to that, you're going to label the things that you saw in the photo, the reason why you took the image. So I'm going to say I see a turret in this picture. I see um, double hung windows. And it looks like um, siding. So I know that those are there based off of the photo because I took that myself. Um, and there might be some other ones over here, but I'm just going to say three. So you just need to find 20 items total. So then you would come down here and do the same thing again. Insert your next picture and then type the things in. So you just need to make sure that you have 20 items total minimum for the whole assignment. And that's how you insert the photos. Again, feel free to make that a little bit bigger.